my mom only had a high school education and I think my dad had some other like maybe a trade school or something yeah. but I'm, he's an electrician so I think he might have had like a, a short trade school but that's about it. My mom has an associate degree that took two years and um, my dad he I think finished high school, middle school, I don't think so. For a while I thought maybe I didn't want to go to college and then I worked at a fast food restaurant <laughs> and then I knew I wanted to go to college. There wasn't anything that could stop me. She, she yeah. was like not ready for this picture. I just took it. But um, like I just thought that my mom would be my future because mm -hmm. like my I'm working really hard right now in school and it's just for my mom because she's never had a chance to go to school so you know, I'm sorry, I get really emotional. But um, like my mom has never had a chance to go to school and people are always give her a hard time. So I just think that it'd be great if I could finish school for her. I used to get like little books, the little books that came with the handle on the side. And like, I would read them. Cause my mom read to me over and over and over until I actually know how to memorize the words that I would read them to her. I would bring a book to her and I literally have her to read it to me. So, cause I had a sister and an older cousin, like, and she would like color with him and stuff. And then she had to focus on my sister cause my sister is handicapped. She doesn't walk or talk. So my way of getting attention is like sneaking that book in, like, hey, hey, what, what? <laughs> I was never a big book reader, I was a slow reader, and video games were how I read. It was how I escaped. People read books and they could escape. I couldn't escape because I read too slow, so the story would go too slow. But when I played video games, I didn't have to read quickly. I could go at my own pace, I could make my own story, but still go along the guidelines of uh, the game story. Fifth grade came around and Harry Potter, and I was like, oh, Harry Potter is so cool and like I got into I, I got really into Harry Potter and then like you know I started thinking about it and I was like you know like writing can get you like it can really get you thinking about all sorts of things but you can create your own world and like nobody could tell you that that world couldn't, couldn't exist because it's your own world and like they don't see that you know it's in your mind mm -hmm. so I mean I think writing is a great way of just expressing yourself. I was never really the best writer, like I had the ideas and I could never really draw, but I loved video games so I kind of just took, I kind of knew my limits and took what I could do and ran with it. So if I could, if I can't draw with my hands, maybe I can use a mouse or some uh, stylus pen to draw a character and if I can't write a story, maybe I can just make a story in my head and tell that to someone else and they could work with me to make the story. Me and my friend, um, actually last year, uh, the beginning of my senior year, we decided to form a little band and it was just our acoustic guitars and we actually made some songs. We made like a little CD that was like seven songs. It was a lot of fun, like we did it over GarageBand on her Mac and like, I don't know, we had a really good time with it. I just got the Apple computer for graduation this year so I could use it in college and I like just found pictures and like found out how to load them in and I just decided to do it like this. I really like it and I hang it in my room in my dorm. I've given it to my family like we even named it Running With Scissors and our band was The Afternoon Frenzy and but now we can't do it because she lives like an hour away. I love music and stuff like that but I know that I can't get other places like by doing other things, like with writing. That's what I eventually, that's what I want to end up doing, whatever it is, writing. But music is just something that, you know, something I like to do, it's fun for me.